Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Dear students, I hope all of you are well by the grace of Almighty Allah. I am also well. Welcome to our online platform of NAVS Home School. Here I am Muhammad Farooq Hussain, Assistant English Teacher of National Indian University School, Day Shift. Now I am going to conduct an English class for the students of class 6. And this class is about your assignment number 1 regarding English. Okay? Dear students, you know that on your assignment, uh, there are a lot of writings. So, although there are a lot of writings, so it is not very easy to uh, understand what is written here. So, I will request all of you to get this writing from your Facebook group or from our school's Facebook group. That means, National Latin English Version School. From this group, you will collect this assignment. Okay? So, let's try to solve what's written here class 6 subject english assignment number 1 uh, this assignment's title a conversation with a doctor about sickness okay the students so uh, in your cover page at the place of title you will write it a conversation with a doctor about sickness that's enough then after writing the title, you will go to the uh, next uh, option, learning object or content. Student will be able to participate in short dialogues and conversation on familiar topics. Use punctuation uh, accurately. That means uh, you have to make a conversation which is called dialogue and for using uh, punctuation marks, you have to be careful. Just use, that means uh, at the use, at the time of using punctuation marks, you have to be careful uh, or you have to utilize the punctuation marks properly. Then guidelines for writing assignment or steps or stages. That means how will you write it? Huh? One of your family members has been sick. Restaurants, that means directly you are not sick. One of your family members, it may be you, but although it's said that one of your family members, that means you are not included. If you are included, then it was uh, written that it wasn't that you are sick. Okay. Uh, you have found some health problems in him or her, such as that means uh, in your family, someone is sick and he or she may be affected by fever, headache, body pain, cough. Now write a conversation with a doctor. Uh, your conversation should include the following points. Okay, that means uh, your conversation would be with a doctor and it should be regarding question and answer. That means one will arise question or ask question and another will answer it. Health problems. Although it's uh, related this kind of problem, so it must be health problem. Uh, then health and hygiene. Then how uh, will he or she get, can get remedy? Then WS and yes no questions. Distance, you know that questions can be formed by two ways. One is WS question and another is by arranging auxiliary verbs at the beginning of the uh, interrogative sentences. So, if you bring uh, w, uh, auxiliary verb at the beginning of uh, uh, at the beginning of interrogative question, uh, sentence, its answer should be yes or no. So, be alert on this point. Then, number four, proper punctuations. That means you have to use proper punctuations. And another note is for you is given. Your conversation must contain five courses and their answers are 10 exchanges of statement. The students, uh, here you may face some difficulties. Imagine that uh, your name is Rana, okay? Rana, imagine that Rana will arise a question and doctor, okay. Doctor will answer it. So, this is conversation one. I like this, it would be uh, all these 
true makes conversation one so it will contain only one so like this you may give in total five conversations or in total one two in total this if you count on this way then it would be in total 10 it's not mandatory to give only 10 or only five conversation but uh, the length uh, of your assignment should not be too much big that means it should not be if your handwriting is medium then it should not be uh, more than two pages it should be within one page or one and a half page okay now dear students let's come how will you start it uh, after writing title you will go to the main pages of the uh, assignment of your copy okay dear students imagine that this is your page okay so i am telling you uh, firstly that although it's your first assignment so you are not allowed to write the both pages of your assignment you will write only one page at your assignment copy now how will you write it number one first of all you will write that answer to the question number one okay after writing this uh, although here is not any specific name so you may give your name you imagine that you know my name is Farouk okay so you will write your name here or any name what you can wish then another conversation would be with whom doctor so at the first conversation I like this what I can write mm, imagine that good afternoon doctor and how are you okay the students in this conversation you just may write uh, like this good afternoon doctor how are you and on reply what will the doctor say good afternoon to dear then how are you that means um well after writing this the doctor will say how can i help you restaurants then another conversation would be you restaurants i have just written up to this but be alert that at the time of writing conversation on this part only listener and speaker would be written here your writing should not be come here that means your writing should be on that part at the time of writing dialogue be alert of this point your writing would not come on this point on this part here would be only only the speaker and the listener that's first i'll not complete it uh, by writing uh, the whole uh, dialogue you have to complete it by yourselves and i'm just helping you in this regard after that it was in that um, you told that sir this is my younger sister or younger brother uh, who is suffering from uh, fever headache or cough and cough then uh, the doctor told that very sad then uh, the doctor doctor may ask uh, uh, if uh, or whether uh, he or she has any body pain uh, then only pray you or your younger or younger brother or sister may told that yes sir i have also body pain then the doctor will say okay don't be uh, worry i am uh, giving you some medicines and some advices too um, uh, just maintain or take proper rest for seven days or uh, take these medicines and in this how you will get cure or you would be okay uh, within two or three days inshallah then in this how you can uh, finish the dialogues and after uh, writing all this you can give thank you sir then 
greets greets him or her that means the doctor then you may complete writing the dialogue dear students uh, this is all about today's dialogue and submission date submission date is uh, next saturday that means this next next saturday uh, would be uh 26 okay this is your submission date and if you face any problem regarding this uh dialogue just contact with me i will solve inshallah this is the end of today's class assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh